now dear student we are going to uh, discuss question number 3.23 and in this question it is given to you a uh, three wheelers start from rest okay it means initial velocity is given to you this is zero initial velocity we have zero accelerate uniformly with acceleration 1 meter per second square so this is 1 meter per second square and on a straight road for 10 seconds so value of t this is given 10 second clear then it move with uniform velocity fine plot the distance covered by the vehicle during nth second okay and what do you expect uh, to be plot this acceleration motion it is a straight line or a parabola clear so now concentrate on a screen <coughs> actually here we will draw a graph this is between x and t it is given to you yes we have to plot here a graph between distance covered and the with the time so distance covered by the vehicle during nth second versus n clear so now we can write like this we can say this is distance covered in an nth second and with n clear we can put here value of n let's suppose this is 0 here we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and we can write like this this is 9 10 11 and so on clear we can write up to 12 this is 12 clear to you yes or no now if we say here our objective here is to calculate ascent it means distance covered by a uh, distance covered by three wheeler in nth second clear to everyone so now we can write like this as nth we know formula what do you know formula yes this is u plus a by 2 twice n minus 1 this three wheeler is starting from rest it means initial velocity we have 0 acceleration is given 1 so we can write like this 1 by 2 2 n minus 1 clear so directly we can see ascent this is given by 1 by 2 2 n minus 1 clear to you yes or no so ascent ascent is equal to what 1 by 2 2 n minus 1 clear so this one now we will draw here a table and after, after the table we will draw here a graph clear actually it is given in a question it is moving accelerating uniformly for 10 seconds clear and after that it is going with a uniform velocity clear so for the 10 second can we draw here a graph so first we are actually uh, drawing here a table so listen carefully so let's suppose if I draw here a table like this we can say uh, this is what we can say this is ascent distance covered and we have here one clear so if we put value of n equal to 1 clear so if we put n equal to 1 we have here 1 1 by 2 this is 0 0.5 if we put value 2 clear we can say 2 multiply 2 4 minus 1 3 by 2 this is 1.5 if we put here value 3 clear if we put 3 we have 5 5 divided by 2 2.5 if we have 4 4 means 2 multiply 4 8 minus 1 7 this is 3.5 if we have 5 clear we have 9 so we can say 4.5 if we have 6 clear we can say 11 so this is 5.5 if we have 7 clear we can say 13 13 by 2 this is 6.5 if we have 8 clear we can say 16 or we can say 15 so this is 7.5 if we have 9 we can say 17 by 2 it means 8.5 clear and if we put here 10 then we can say uh, 19 so we can say 9.5 clear so now if we plot here a graph we can plot like this for n equal to 1 clear I am taking here let's suppose this is 0 0.5 clear 1.5 this is 2.5 3.5 4.5 clear 5.5 6.5 then we can write like this 6.5, 7.5, 8.5, 5 clear so now in this uh, question it is given to you for n equal to 1 0.5 so we are here we have clear 
then we can say at n equal to 2 1.5 it means this one then we have this graph clear we can say we have this much of graph yes or no clear to you now 4 5 we can say this is 4.5 yes or no 4 5 we have 4.5 6 we can say 5.5 you can take here as a suitable scale clear clear so now listen carefully now if we join all the dots it will be look like this up to 10 clear to you up to 10 this one clear but what will happen after 10 seconds after 10 seconds this three wheeler is going with uniform velocity it means we can see we can see after 10 seconds its position is not changing with the time clear or uniform velocity means we can say equal change in position we have for equal interval of time so we can say it will be like this or we can say slope of xt graph it will be zero yes or no yes or no so we can say uh, this is a graph between we can say distance covered in nth second versus we can say n clear to everyone so what do you expect from this plot so we can say from 0 to directly we can say up to uh, we can say for n equal to 1 to n equal to 10 we have here a straight line and after that we have a line or a graph this is parallel to n clear to everyone so this is all about this question but important this will not pass through zero always keep in mind clear this will not passes through zero clear to everyone so now dear student you know here we have at 10 uh, n equal to 10 we have ascent value this is 9.5 clear and after n we can see after this 10 clear it is given that uh, after 10 second we can see it is moving with uniform velocity so can we find here velocity of a three wheeler after 10 second yes so we can write like this actually we know v equal to u plus 80 clear v equal to u plus 80 so we can say v equal to initial we have zero this is what 9.8 multiply t so or we can say acceleration acceleration is given this is one clear and time this is 10 clear so we can say this is 10 meter per second so we can say at n equal to 10 clear we can say this is 10 meter per second clear to everyone so this is all about this question